name is Christophe Poppe. I work at Genf as an IT manager. Genf is a private equity player, so we invest in companies, we make them grow. We have um, roughly about uh, 2 billion uh, euros in, in assets we manage. Our main office is, in, is located in Antwerp. Uh, we have also offices in the Netherlands, in France and in Germany. IT security is very important for us since we are a listed company. We cannot afford that we have some data breach uh, regarding companies we are looking at or uh, regarding financial information we are getting from those companies. Email is our lifeline. Um, that means when we should have a breach, uh, the complete EGIMF environment uh, comes to a technical standstill. Our challenge was to have an upgraded firewall uh, with a simplified management, since we are a rather small IT department. We came to Checkpoint uh, by a security checkup. First of all, uh, the security checkup was carried out in our environment to see, okay, what is the current status of our environment. Um, some specific uh, things came up uh, during that, uh, that checkup. It was very useful for us. We used the threat emulation for every incoming and outgoing uh, mail that has an attachment, about 10,000 files each month. The attachment is uploaded to the threat emulation cloud and about uh, two, three uh, emails during each week are prevented by the threat emulation. Now in the IT department, as a benefit, we have uh, one single dashboard for reporting. We can manage all our firewalls from one central point. Business-wise, the benefits, uh, we can call them that we now have an, uh, even a higher uptime regarding our infrastructure and the end users are guaranteed that their emails are checked uh, more than one time uh, on malicious code. The speed of processing of the threat emulation is very important for us, uh, since we are sometimes expecting uh, binding legal documents by email uh, on, a, on a very time critical base. The threat emulation blade is providing us that speed. At this moment, we didn't have any zero-day attacks, but we already prevented some zero-day attacks using the threat emulation mode.